Home and Away goes back in time. Today I'm here with Ariane Wynne Parks Lockwood, who plays Olivia Bly on A Place to Call Home. Welcome to the 1950s, Demi. Thank you. <laughs> and the lovely Miss Pixie is here to help us get the 50s look. Ta-da! Welcome to Boogie Bob Day. Thank you. Are you ready? Yes. We're going to transform you into a vintage pinup girl. Excellent. I'm yeah. excited. Good girl. Here we go. So when we're trying to achieve that 1940s and 50s hairstyle, we need to work with two sections of the hair. So we have the front and the back. And the front of the hair, because that's what people see when you first walk into a room, has to be really elaborate and huge. So we need to part the hair from behind the back of the ears, right over the top of the head to behind the back of the other ear. This is great. It's quite different from um, Olivia's look in the show. Absolutely. It's quite sort of demure. She and is. And foxier. She's conservative yeah. and yes, that, that beautiful ensemble of a 1950s housewife, whereas this is that whole, you know, silver screen siren walking down the red carpet. Ready? We're going to do the makeup now. Okay, so we're going to try and achieve that really flawless dolly look. So you need to use a foundation that's obviously um, of the same skin colour as you. Okay, now for the false eyelashes. All right, here we go. Daddy's gone, gone for all money. So I find that liquid eyeliner is a lot easier to use. If you just ever so gently pull the side of the eye, it'll give you that perfect line and it'll also dictate to you where your natural flick should be. When you're applying liquid eyeliner on yourself at home, in the mirror, what you need to do is lift the chin so that the eye is half shut and that way you'll get a smooth line effect. Did you know that everybody's lips are uneven? That's actually a known fact. So when you're applying lipstick, what you want to make sure you do is you get, do get the appearance of your lips being even. It's always good to use a pencil mm -hmm. and then once you've got the shape, you can colour in, so to speak, with some lippy. She'll bet those pretty lashes. I've never had my hair like this before. <gasps> well, hopefully you love it as mm -hmm. much as I do. I always say bigger is better, so <laughs> don't, don't be too shocked <laughs> when you see. I think it's far larger than what you're normally used to. <gasps> oh, wow! Those lashes are amazing. And that white is so cool. Wow. I can't believe that's my hair. That's your hair. And there's no padding in there. That's just literally your hair. Oh, lovely. Bring your face around to me. Don't look at me when you do that. Yeah. <laughs> you bring that. Keep your hands nice and soft. That's the girl. Previously hey. on Desperate Housewives. <laughs> Ariane, yeah, I don't know about you, but I had the best time today. Good. Yes, <laughs> I was too. definitely born in the wrong era. Before we say goodbye, we also have to thank Miss Pixie over here, who did our hair and makeup and dressed us. So thank you, Pixie. Oh, you are more than welcome. Thank you for joining me this and so spending a, a time back in time, literally. Yes, it's so much fun. <laughs> we got it together, girls. Yay! <laughs>